about a week, the Roanoke Rescue Mission has raised the white flag, signaling its doors are open to anyone needing a warm place to stay. Another place in the New River Valley is also providing comfort to homeless men and women. Ten News reporter Irisha Jones tells us how they're also making a difference in the lives of those at the shelter. Melvin Robertson knows what it's like to be homeless. I lost my home and I was out there and this program got me back on my feet. Um, it gave me confidence and that's, that's a big step. He started out sleeping on beds like these. Now he works with To Our House, helping others. Our overall mission is to kind of like get the um, men and women back into society. You know, give them a leg up on what's available in the community. To Our House is in its 10th housing season. From November to late March, the winter overnight shelter opens to single men and women in the New River Valley. The shelter is held at a different church every week. Our Savior Lutheran Church is one of the many volunteers. If somebody doesn't feel like they're, they don't feel comfortable spending the night, then they volunteer to, to uh, wash the towels. Or if, um, if they're not able to do that, then they, they can make a meal or they can donate the food items. So it's just a, a way to be involved in the community. TOH also connects people at the shelter with community resources. We've had about a 40% success rate in getting people into jobs and more affordable housing. The shelter also provides food and evening activities. The doors are open and we're ready for them. For more information on places you can go overnight during the winter months, visit our website at WSLS.com. In Christiansburg, Arisha Jones, 10 News, working for you.